morning, I joined a group of volunteers in support of the Smoots Bay Project on the Potomac River. This was a collaborative effort by Maryland Department of Natural Resources, the Chesapeake Bay Foundation, and National Harbor to restore wildlife habitat lost over the last 15 years. Over three days, volunteers formed concrete reef balls to use as a hard foundation in fish habitat where grasses have already been restored. So the fish that are likely to use these reef balls include largemouth bass, catfish, uh, minnows, might see some white perch, maybe some striped bass, may even see some uh, invertebrates. Animals need a variety of places to feed, reproduce, and feel protected. And those are the opportunities this reef aims to supply for wildlife. Because it's not just going to be the balls, it's also going to be some woody material that we submerge in the water too. And a lot of critters out there like that stuff. There are many places in the Chesapeake Bay in need of restoration, but this location was selected because it had a high likelihood of success and the right amount of support. It may look like hard work, but volunteers described it as a fun and rewarding experience. So today is the first time that we have done reef balls. We demolded the reef balls. The concrete was already poured and we had a heck of a lot of fun. Now to see if the fish like our efforts. It was really fun pulling out all those balloons and the little crevices to make sure that the crevices stayed open for the fish. To join other events like this, or to make a donation to the construction effort of future reefs, follow the Department of Natural Resources and the Chesapeake Bay Foundation on social media. We hope you'll join us next time as we're building a piece of our future and preserving the Chesapeake Bay.